Uh, what does everyone think of Resident Evil Reverse? The, that looks uh, a lot of fun, and people can shut the fuck up. <laughs> for, for people that don't know, it's a it's looking to be a PvP shooter where you're playing as like uh, from protagonists from the series as well as um, mm-hmm. stuff like Tyrants, Mister X, and Nemesis and whatnot. It's almost looking like the first person to die turns into one of the monsters and then and then it's then it becomes like a dead a uh, uh, dead by daylight style but everybody else has to work to kill them at least that's what it's looking like to me which i'm 100 percent down for i think people are being just too fucking harsh on it i th- correct me if i'm wrong they said it was going to be packaged with uh village right yes it- if you buy village you get free access to it okay so it's kind of like the resistance situation where if you bought three you got access to that you need to buy a any version of eight doesn't have to be the like deluxe or the collectors to get access to this i don't anticipate that i'll play it for very long or whether that what if, if i'm using um resistance as a basis um i don't think it'll necessarily be but that honestly, great but, but it is a dumb it's it is, not I'm, the same thing <laughs> no, I understand. Like, like, it's just like as a basis for president. Uh, it's honest- obviously not going to have the production value of the main game. Yeah. But that being said, it, it's a free thing. It's not detracting from the quality of the main game. So, um, yeah, it, it's, it's a free thing. No reason to like outright condemn it. Uh, what were you going to say, Corey? It's basically kind of like a Resident Evil brawl game. You know, are they going to have tripping physics? <laughs> maybe every five steps you take you just fucking slam on your face <laughs> yeah <laughs> technically you could trip over zombies in two and three in the I, remakes you you could you would stumble but you wouldn't full-on fall on well, your like, face trip you would like stumble over that yeah so. what about you mace any interest in pvp resident evil I mean, sure I, I never I, I never have to play uh three remake and I didn't play the resistance mode it's literally the first I heard of this. What you guys were talking about? Oh, wow. so um, yeah, again, absolutely nothing. I've been busy. <laughs> um, um, but yeah, sure. I mean, it just sounds like mercenaries. Yeah, I mean, it's yeah, free. Sure. It's something to play. Yeah, why can't not? Ar- can't argue with that. Yeah, well, let me say no, no. <laughs> I just hope they have a. I hope they have a buttload of um. DLC like they did with Resident Evil 7. Mm. 7 had a lot of really interesting DLC. There was um there was a free not a hero which is kind of like a very small like little mini campaign. It's like 2 or 3 hours. But it's there really was, good and it had no right to be free. <laughs> mm-hmm. There was where you play as Sarah called him a hill hillbilly uncle. I said um, hillbilly Joe or something. I forget. Yeah. Because I couldn't I, remember his name. I think his name might actually be Joe. I, I, yeah. I, I, it's, it might yeah. be. Oh, is it? I'm pretty sure. Oh, shit. <laughs> or I think I called him Hillbilly Bayou Man, too. I forget what I actually I, I be- called I believe It doesn't called. matter. He punches zombies with his fists. He does. <laughs> and then he gets super fists and he punches things harder. <laughs> it, it, yeah, it had that. So it had like two campaigns. It had like a what if scenario with Zoe. There was like a morbid version of, I think it was like Blackjack or 21. And there was like a, it was almost like a mercenaries like arcade mode where you have to feed Jack and like kill enemies in the area. And then, and, there's, uh, I, and then there's literally don't uh, or Ethan must die. Oh yeah, which is which like was just, basically extra hard. Yeah. <laughs> and it, it actually it actually kind of stands out now that I think about it that two and three didn't really have two had some free uh, DLC. I think it was called like the survivors thing. It's like three kind of. Yeah, not many campaigns like little mini levels that reuse levels and assets from the main yeah. game. Uh, there's no real story school. to it, but uh, it was something. But like not, nothing on the same level or scale as the Resident Evil Seven DLC. Yeah, 